this is a great point. A lot of people want fizzy carbonated drinks and you can't get that out of a tablet. So short answer is we're not gonna overcome this problem. The reason your canned and bottled sodas are fizzy is because they've got a lot of carbon dioxide, super saturated solution dissolved and then held under pressure in a vessel. As soon as you open the bottle or the can, it rapidly leaks out. We all know if you leave a glass of something out, it will gradually lose bubbles over the course of, say, an hour or two. Same process, but it happens quicker with an Incredible. When you drop an Incredible into a glass of water, immediate reaction produces CO2. But it doesn't produce anywhere near as much as you'd get in a can, nor is there any pressure to hold it in there. So it leaves relatively quickly. So they're slightly fizzy to begin with, but it doesn't last anywhere near as long. And that's basic chemistry. That isn't something we're ever going to be able to overcome. Well, that I can think of. So the short answer is we're not going to be able to solve this problem. But we're solving a few others. And I know a lot of people do have carbonation machines in their homes. So people who do like a super fizzy soda can make them at home easy enough. Or they'll take them with them to bars, of course, have soda water. Or maybe they'll taste so goddamn good if you don't miss the bubbles.